Yes. Da 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 da. -da. Ouch! Ouch! Ooh, bomb scratch. I'm good. I'm good. Let's do this. In this video, I take you tubing through some dark blaze caves. I show you some of the things we did and saw walking through the bushes to the river. My name is Mickey. Keep watching. Hello everyone, Miki here. Welcome to my channel where I draw lessons from life experience and I also share my experience with the places that I am went, which at the moment is Belize in Central America. So if you like to experience new things from the places that I will be working, please subscribe to come on my journey with me. Thank you very much. Let's get into the video. Do you remember my introduction video for Belize? Belize also has an extensive network of cave systems. Over 150 miles of caves have been mapped with many more still to be explored. One of these cave systems known as ATM, which is short for Akpun to the Til Muknal, has been named one of the most sacred caves in the world by the National Geographic. I got a chance to experience some of these caves in Belize through cave tubing. Come with me and enjoy. It started with a brief walk through the bushes to the starting point. It was actually nice and insightful. What are these thorny trees? They are all over Belizean forests and not fun when you brush against them. Please let me know in the comment section if you know what they are. We also came across these palm tree lookalikes. They produce these fruits that looks a little bigger than the usual palm nuts and taste like coconuts but really hard to crack. Desiree, one of our tour guides and the daughter of the land, comes in and breaks it with only one strike. The only way I can describe the taste of this fruit is, imagine coconuts and palm nuts had a cake. It will turn out to be this fruit. Please let me know in the comment section if you know what this fruit is.
We finally got to the starting point and it's safe to say it was a bumpy start. One thing about cave tubing, I wouldn't recommend it to pastrophobics. Being in the dark and not knowing what is happening under the water can be a little bit intimidating. And yes, it does get dark. shiny stones please let me know in the comment section if you know what they are these holes are homes for bats I'm not sure if I'm allowed to call them bat holes it was nice to eventually see natural light in the end
There you have it, guys. Cave tubing in Belize. If you'd like to have this wonderful experience, please contact Let's Be Native, Explore Belize, and Hannah, Desiree, and Tim will look after you. I will leave their socials in the YouTube video description below. Please do not forget to give this video a like and subscribe if you are new to my channel. Thank you very much for watching and see you in the next video. Mm -hmm.